Remember I said at one time that routers come with their interfaces already shut down and turned off. Switches come with them already running. So we need a command to be able to shut down a port and we need a command to be able to start up a port. Well, there is no startup command. There is a shutdown command, but no startup command. And here's where we learn something new. Whenever you want to do the opposite of a command, you put the word no in front of it. So shut down and no shut down. Now, usually we use the shortcut version of this. and We just say no shut. So let's try this out. I have here a switch and a PC connected to that switch. And the PC is connected to port Ethernet uh, 0, 1. And you can see that that's up and running right here in, the, in this list. So I want to short, uh, shut down FA01. So, and by the way, here is where you can see that it changed the state to up. I'm going to go to enable, and I will go into global config mode, and I will say, I want to go into what? Interface F01. And I will just say shut down. And you see that it, I get this a message here that it has been shut down. And in fact, if I go back here again and put my uh, mouse cursor over it, you can see now it says that the link is down. And you can also see that the link lights have turned red. So let's turn it back on again. I'm still in interface uh, configuration mode here. So I'll put no shut and watch these link lights as soon as I click this the PC side immediately came up there's going to be a delay on the switch side uh, and that's something that uh, uh, we learn later on but it, it takes some time for the switch to go through some negotiation stuff uh, several phases before it actually starts up uh, this is pretty common in switches you have to wait uh, about a minute or so before you can really do anything on that port but it will eventually turn green and you can see here that it says it has changed the state to up and there it is